Welcome back to my channel and today we're gonna do something I've never done a video like this before but somebody requested on my last diaper bag review video for me to do like an update so they wanted to know how is the bag really holding up years later after using it for a while so this is a year later I got this the Fonda um, diaper bag in the mini. I got it last year and I'm gonna let you guys know all of the deets, how it holds up. And as you know, my little one, she is an older toddler now, potty trained and all, so we are not in diapers anymore, but I will show you what to pack in it or what I pack in it for an older toddler. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Okay guys, so like I said, I have had my bag for a year and I wanna give you an up close look at it because I am not a person that is kind to my bags or baby my bags and I wanna give you an up close look at it to let you know that it ages well. It's like a fine wine. But here is the bag a year later and it is in that blush pink color. And as you can see, it has held up pretty, the straps, well. And then I wanna show you really quick, my other one I've had for over two years, and it has held up pretty well um, also. So that the blush pink one is the mini, and then my black one is the um, larger size, but it is in such great shape even a couple years later. So we are gonna dive deep into the mini bag and I will let you guys know everything I pack in it for an older toddler that is potty trained or already. But, so it has the front zipper pocket here. I don't really keep much in there or if anything, I'm trying to feel. It looks like I have a nail file. <laughs> and glue so you guys um if you're new to my channel i use red aspen nails i have been using them since march of last year so it's coming up almost on a year but when you have on these nails you're gonna need some glue and a nail file just in case things get a little scary so that's what i have in this front zipper pocket and it is in that brass color and easy to open and shut um, this front pocket is pretty big, pretty deep. I can stick my hand completely in there. And I just store hair ties for me and my daughter. So the little skinny black ones and then a bigger one for me if I wanna do a messy bun or something. So there, there's hair on it too. So that's that front pocket. And like I said, it is pretty deep. I can fit my whole hand down in it. So you could even put, I don't put my cell phone there because guys, it's like the front of it. People could easily reach their hand in there. If you are looking for a diaper bag or just a bag for, if you have children, the backpack is it. Like, I don't know how people do anything else. I wouldn't get anything else but a diaper bag backpack. And Fawn Design, and this video is not sponsored, I purchased these bags at full price with my own money but i love their bags because this vegan leather leather it wears well it holds its shape and it cleans easily especially if you have kids and you're like me you're not going to baby your bags it's just going to wear really well and then in addition to that as well i like the vegan leather leather because if you get a mark i remember i got a pin mark on it i just took a little dry erase um 
what do you call it, sponge, or you can take a little Dawn soap and scrub and it's gonna come off and it won't rub off this coloring for their vegan leather. leather. So that's why I really love this bag. So on the side, we have two side pockets and these are not super deep. So maybe you're gonna put, you can put your hair ties and stuff like that in here, a snack, but you're not fitting a water bottle in these sides. They're just not big enough. And then there's one on this area. And then this is for the crossbody part or to hang on your stroller. We don't really use a stroller anymore, um, but if you are have a stroller and stuff like that, these are great for that. And the stroller attachments, I have those as well in the blush pink color, but those are an additional charge. And I will have everything linked down below if you guys are interested. And then let's get into the bulk of the bag. So you open it up, the zipper is in that brass color as well, and the whole thing is that vegan leather. I think that's why it wears so well. So inside, um, I have, I this year I was like, I'm gonna start journaling. So I picked up this one. It's not for children, it's let that go and i got this um, journal off amazon and it's just really great not only does it look cute it's just really good and if you are sitting waiting for your kids at any practices or um, any sporting whatever they do journaling is so good to do so i have this journal that i try to keep in this bag so any spare time i can jot a few things down read the funny quotes but this is a really good one and it's funny and then I'll show you inside the bag. So it's surrounded by a ton of pockets. Um, I also have my wallet. Like I said, your wallet could probably fit in that front part, but you want things secure. So I have the Tory Burch wallet um, in the chevron pattern. I have a whole video where I do an unboxing of my wallet and my purse. You guys can see I love that blush pink color. This is more of a neutral, but it has those blush pink tones. But yeah, I just keep my wallet in there. Perfect, it just fits nicely on top and it's under the zipper, so nice and secure. And then let's get into the bottom of the bag. So we are in COVID time, so I carry around my antibacterial wipes, but these ones are special because they are for the hands and the face. So you can use them on your actual body. So I love that. I carry these most of the time now since my daughter is not potty training instead of regular wipes, and they are good, so they're gonna disinfect and keep things clean. And in the bottom, she is potty trained, but you know, kids are kids, and if she ever had an accident, or you know how they are, if they spill water or something, she always wants to change. So I have, and I just have it secured with an elastic hair tie, um, one of her bows, she's a bow headband girl, and then just an easy dress to slip on. And then now we're gonna get into the other pockets. So this water bottle, I like the metal ones. I picked this one up from Target, but you can find these on Amazon as well. I will link a few of our favorites, but I just have her water bottle in here filled with water. Some snacks, you always need some snacks. So I have a little protein nutty bar and then also a pouch. I like to throw snacks in here because maybe we won't use them for a few times, just stuff that doesn't go bad easily that you can have in your bag for a little bit of time. And then underwear, and I also have that rolled up and secured for her with an elastic. And like I said, she rarely ever, ever has accidents, but you know how they are. My daughter could get like a drop of pee if this is too much for you, I'm sorry, but she'll get a drop of pee and then she wants to change. So we have these to avoid all of the drama that will come. So two pairs of underwear rolled up. And then we are in COVID time, so I have our mask in here. So I have one for her and one for me. And these ones I just keep in here and they are, um, 
We always have one on, but those can just be easy grab, or if we get our other one dirty or soiled, we have extra ones. But that is kind of it. That is all that I really pack in our diaper bag now that she is a big girl. And it's just, even though she's not in diapers, it's always great just to be hands-free. So as a mama of any amount of kids, two, three, for whatever you have, bringing a backpack is just essential. And then on the back, they do have those straps. And these don't completely click off, but you can undo this and put them in here and then do that crossbody if you like that look better. But then they also have a big pocket in the back where you could store like a tablet or something like that. But I also, another reason I love this backpack is that my daughter, as she's getting older, this can be her backpack. And it's really cute. It's in one of her favorite colors and it just works for us. So I hope you guys really like this video. This was my Fawn Design Backpack, Diaper Bag Backpack review a year later. And I just wanna tell you that if you are on the fence about to spend the money, they are not the cheapest bags. If you're on the fence, should I get it, should I not? It's gonna hold up well and it's gonna hold its value. So take the plunge, but thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next one. Bye guys. Mm -hmm.